absolutely you want to stay organized. You want to prioritize. You want to identify your life roles. One thing that I encourage you to do is purchase a planner, list out your to-dos for the day, your goals for the day, and stick to that structure. Also, you don't want to become that go-to person. That's the person that everybody comes to to take on an extra activity or project. You either want to say no to those people or begin setting boundaries. First and foremost, it's really important to recognize that when you say no, the payoff is in the end, when you walk away with less roles and responsibilities. See, so often we say yes and we get that instant gratification. We see a smile on someone's face, but we walk away with so many extra to-dos. So it's recognizing with no, the payoff is in the end. No also shows self-control. When you say no to somebody, they actually see you as in control of your life and priorities. And if you want to say no without feeling guilty, when you do say no, you can follow it up with options and resources to get the person jump-started in their project. convenient mini meals on the go like Lala yogurt smoothies. Right now, Lala actually has two new amazing products at market. The first one is Lala Healthy's Curb. It actually does what it says. It curbs your appetite, your cravings, and sustains energy throughout the day. Lala also offers uh, Lala 100 calorie. Oh, I love pontooning on my boat. So hashtag yogurting while pontoon boating. Go to lalafoods.com for everything that you need to know.